My name is Samna Arila, uh, pronounced T-S-U-M-N-A, Avila. I am a 34-year-old reporter. I grew up in the um, Pico Union area of Los Angeles. I was born and raised there. I was um, always, I've always been interested in writing actually. Uh, my mother taught me how to write when I was uh, two years old. She basically forced me to learn how to write when I was two years old. And eventually I learned to love it. Um, when I was in elementary I used to write songs for a uh, little kid that, a kid that used to sing at bars. And uh, my idea was that I wanted to be a lyric lyricist. Uh, many teachers, uh, when I would tell teachers, they would tell me, ask me if I wanted to be a, song, a singer, a uh, songwriter. And to me that was not really what I wanted. I really wanted to write it. Um, later on, I uh, experimented with poetry. And when I came into junior high, I discovered journalism. Um, after taking journalism in junior high and high school, I decided to take another route and go into business. I got my AS in business. I worked in the corporate world for a few years. And I also went into, uh, took a class, took a, uh, took a few classes and got a certificate as a legal assistant. And I was doing some uh, legal assistant type work also. Um, however, I was never quite happy because that was not where my calling was. And um, I continued going to school and got my degree in journalism in 2005 from Cal State Long Beach. Right now I'm working on several projects uh, with uh, local magazines. Um, I was recently laid off of, uh, as an editor for a uh, new magazine called Clout. Uh, that the uh, press telegram was putting out. Uh, so after that I decided to uh, take on some freelance work and I'm uh, doing some work for Blade, for Edge Las Vegas and for uh, In Los Angeles Magazine. Right now because I'm freelancing and it's my daily living I'm really not even living paid to, to paycheck because I have to see when I get paid as a freelancer. You don't get paid necessarily as soon as uh, you write the article, you get paid until after your article publishes. And even that may take a month or a month and a half. So, um, you know, it's very, really a hard industry right now. Being a journalist, if I stop being a journalist, it, I, it would be like stop being, being something, stripping a part of me from my being. Um, I love being a journalist, I love writing, I love the, the power the, that you have in creating something from scratch, getting the different people's quotes and making it into a complete story that makes sense, that attracts readers, uh, that lets people know about what's going on in their world. I've always had respect for the, the, the position because as journalists, no matter whether you're a photojournalist, a broadcast journalist, a newspaper journalist, you have an online, nowadays, an online journalist, we have the ability to change the world. We are letting people know what's going on in this world that they would never even know. So to me, being a journalist is a heroic career. If you're a young as a journalist, an aspiring journalist, I would advise the same thing I, advi I would advise anybody in any position. Go into the career because you love it. Not because you want to be rich or because you want money. If you're going to do something, do it for the love of it. Because after all, this is what you're going to be doing for a better part of your life. So enjoy it and everything will fall into place by itself.